All right, so uh, I've played a little bit of the My Career already. wasn't really planning on recording it. But uh, now, I guess I'm just going to do it for you guys. So I I'd only like got to officially a, uh, welcome our newest recruit oh. to the start of his WWE journey. You come into our sport, think it's going to be easy. But you're in for a real wake-up call. If you ask me, I think he's going to do big things here. Look out. Superman punch! And that shovel's an equalizer. Spear! This is going to be one for the ages. We are going to give you the foundation to succeed in WWE. What you do with it is up to you. All right, so uh, I played a little. I got right up to me picking my brand, and then I decided I should record. So past that, so I this is it. What's happening? Day one of training at the WWE Performance Center. As you can see, it looks like everyone heard I was coming and decided they'd be better off staying home. This is cool, but there's no way my journey ends here. I'm going to WWE and then straight to the top, where I make sure hey, that- what are you doing? You're an hour and a half early for your orientation. I was just... checking out the facility? <laughs> There'll be plenty of time for that later. How did you even get in here? Guy up front let me in. Oh, big guy with the mustache? Kinda sweaty? Yep. Well, that's Todd's final strike. Hope he enjoys early retirement. Uh, I'll take off the Oh, no need to get anyone in trouble. He uh definitely checked my ID and even did a pat down. Really thorough. So Todd's all right in my book. I feel very safe in his big sweaty hands. Fine, whatever. Anyway, you're going to need to fill out your information on this and sign a bunch of waivers before you can begin training today. And when you're done with all that, there's actually a fun part. You get to design your wrestling gear in case you become a WWE superstar. You mean when I become a WWE superstar? Yeah, sure. Wait, have you been filming this entire time? Is that a problem? Filming's not allowed in here without prior consent, which you uh -oh. should have been told by security. Frickin' Todd. Turn it off, please. Okay, so I get to decide. Uh. Get to decide what I'm going to do. I'm probably going to do either pro athlete or indie. I'm a indie. Be an indie guy. Considering I just stuck there. And uh, this is the part where I... Design my guy. Oh my lord, my controller is drifting like crazy. So this is going to take a while. But I'm going to design everyone, design me, and uh, I'll be right back with you. Here we go. Look at me. My dapper self. I don't know why I'm facing that way, but I got a, I got a red and black theme going on, and I'm going to stick to it. I got a nice jacket and everything for my, my entrance, but uh, we all just got to wait till I make it to the big leagues, so... Now, last time I did this, I signed with NXT, or no, no, with NXT, with SmackDown, but I kind of don't want to sign with SmackDown. To be fair, I didn't do any matches on SmackDown yet, but I have a plan. My plan is to go to NXT, win all the titles in NXT, go to SmackDown, you done win with all, all that the titles yet? in SmackDown, Just and go to Raw with the trash, to design and win all the like titles that. on Raw, and then retire as the mm, greatest of all I've time. Seen worse. And so of course, now what? Beat the Should I go wait at the, the front desk with you until it's time to start? Front desk. What do you think I do here? I'm Corey Klein, head recruiter and occasional babysitter of people who don't follow instructions and show up way earlier than they're supposed to. Oh, that Corey. Yeah. I guess when we were emailing, I just saw your name and assumed that. You know what? It's nice to meet you in person finally. Go get changed. Then head over to the gym. The other trainees who started last week should be showing up soon. And to clear up any potential confusion on your end, they are men. Got it. Thanks. Okay, let's see what we can do here. Ooh, I can do appearance and stuff already. All right, I'm gonna, I'm just gonna see what this is. This is just clothes, right? Yeah. Can I, 
can I give up? Can I give myself a finisher? I don't want the running hurricane runner. You know what? For now, since I don't see a way to change it, I'm gonna do the sharpshooter because I used to do the yes walk all the time. And I'm gonna do what is this? Okay, I'm gonna I'll do the I'll do ripcord German because I used to do the ripcord knee. So it, it's it's close enough. <laughs> I made myself 5'10", by the way, because that's, that's, I think, I think it was 5'11 in the last game, or I was 5'10", so. Because night is always really short, that's, that's just nice. Jeez, that took a long time to load, okay. Let's change my moveset, I'll be right back with you. We have returned, and I have 205 points, okay, that's crazy. Okay, I'm spending a lot of that on joint. Mission I'm okay at. Aerial and running. Yeah. And that puts me at an 86. That's crazy. Okay, I changed my moveset. I'm not gonna change my entrance for a little. Never compromise, even when others claim they're worthy of your time, they are not. Okay, Paragon. I don't know who you are, but question for any fellow debris fans back there. Gonna get a lot of stands for attitude, I'm sure. But give them, give me the area that gave us the legends, like Chris Clan, Jerry Lawler, any day, hashtag Golden Air. I hear ya, but don't leave my man Macho Man out of that convo. Oh yeah. Interesting. I said recruiter, the PC number for talent, new gear, and then we might have a new career in security. All brand GMs. Scrappy Daddy. And everyone's arguing. Oh, perfect. Oh wait, DMs. Who is DMing me? Looking forward to having you find the delivery. Don't be late for orientation. I leave some extra time for checking in with security. Okay. Let's talk to who do we have to talk to? It's Hector Flores. Hey, new guy, right? I'm Hector Flores. Welcome to the PC. Okay, Hector seems like a nice guy. And he was a nice guy when I said thanks. Thanks. So. And I'm well aware of who you are. I've watched a lot of your matches online. I'm excited to get going, especially since I heard you started last week. I started here, at least. I've been training and wrestling for years before this. It's part of growing up in Mexico. Wait. You didn't have family in the business, did you? No. Where I'm from, you were either into wrestling or football. Sorry. Soccer. I chose wrestling. Soccer is for the week. I'll take super kicks over bicycle kicks any day. Soccer is for the week. I'll choose to ignore that for now. So I heard you trained at Booker T school. What was that like? Why are his eyes? This is great. Booker's great. He gave me the foundation I needed I'm to make it on the indies, tactic. but it Everyone was time to take the next step. And that meant coming here. He put in a word for me, and luckily WWE liked what they saw. Must be nice to have that kind of support. It is, but I don't want anyone to think I only got here because of him. I'm going to prove that I earned this. All right, man. Good luck. You'll see who that guy is in the right in a hey. second. Hey, who are you? It's my first day training here. Who are you? Seriously? Have you not been watching Japanese wrestling for the past six years? I'm Paragon J. Pierce. The biggest free agent WWE signed since AJ Styles. Uh, bigger, actually. I actually know who you are, but no, I don't want your matches. I don't want your boring, crappy style rubbing off on me in any way. Look me up online. Just search for best indie wrestler in the world. Yeah. So you're an indie wrestler, huh? Man, you guys are all the same. Aren't you coming to a wrestler? major promotion thinking Are you an it's going to be easy? But you're for a real wake-up call. I don't plan on being here very long. They actually should have never sent me here to begin with. But I'm going to take this opportunity to send you running back to whatever backyard county fair parking lot indie league you came from. Do you come from an indie league? No talk. You, you came remind from an indie me of league, a bro. lot of the guys I faced on the indie circuit. All talk. 
Luckily for them, they don't have to face me anymore. Unfortunately, you do. Yeah, on a big stage, packed with pressure, like you've never experienced before. You're in my arena now, rookie. And when I'm done with you, you're gonna wish you stayed in your lane. We'll yeah, see. Yeah, buddy. Yeah, you wish. Big you fan. see who this is. Thanks. I'm a big fan of yours, too. How? I've never even had a televised match before. Oh, sorry. I was just trying to be polite. Ah, <laughs> it's okay. I'm relatively new to all this, but you and I have actually appeared on the same indie show in Memphis before. Really? I'm pretty good with faces, and I don't remember yours. Well, that's because you couldn't see my face. I was a mascot named Ribby. You see? He's oh, my yeah, tag partner. Memphis minor league baseball shows. I think I saw you win a yeah, no, we're tag no, we're tag partners. That was me. We were the SWE the tag team was champions. Rub elbows with legends like Jerry the King Lawler. Mm. He found out I was training on the side as a wrestler and actually helped me get a shot here. You see, but Not you're my tag partner, my Chase. Own. Chase, you're my tag partner. Look, I had some help from Booker T getting my foot we're in the door. We're tag partners, but just remember, Ribby. Neither one of us would be here if really? we weren't talented. We are tag partners. You remember the SWB tag titles? That was up. I forget. Can you sign something for me today before you leave? Sure. Sure. Just as long as you don't sell it online. Ah, well, then you know what? I can get it some other time. I'm just messing with you. If you can make a few bucks, then good for you. And literally, it might only be a few bucks. <laughs> See you out there, Jason. Yeah, I gotta be nice to, to Chase and Hector for it. Yeah, Booker T. Woo! Booker T is telling me to do good things. This, this is one I'm. They, I don't care who I upset. I'm the best you in industry. Hey, there's nothing on me. Oh, here it is. Here it is. I'd like to officially welcome our newest recruit to the start of his WWE journey. The rest of you have heard this speech already, so we'll try to make it quick. On our first day, he did the whole ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, children of all ages thing. It was awesome. We'll do the talking, Chase. I was just telling him about your cool DX intro you did. Chase! What Road Dog was getting at is we are going to give you the foundation to succeed in WWE. What you do with it is up to you. Keep in mind, you will be judged at all times. The big man in the sky is always watching. Not that big man. There's a camera up there with a live feed that goes directly to Triple H's office in Stamford. The coaches and PC staff certainly have input, but ultimately, he'll decide when the time's right to bring the GMs from NXT, Raw, and SmackDown here so you can showcase your talents. I'm ready for that now. Yeah, we know you think that, but it's not your call, big shot. Okay. Yeah, Road Now that all that's out like, of the way, uh, we're gonna cool. start with some one-on-one -on -one matches to see where everyone's at. All right, new guy. Since it's your first day, we'll let you choose who you want to face. Okay. Yep. Here he goes. Crazy. Shawn Michaels. Uh, choose from the guy standing next to you. I'm not an You're option. You're Road Dog. <laughs> Look, I could beat one of these guys, but that would be expected. I want to do the unexpected in cool. WWE, like defeating a two-time Hall of Famer on my first day here. I know that might rub people the wrong way, but I don't care. I want to make an impact, and I want to do it right now. Uh, Hunter, you seeing this? This is your chance to say you're kidding. I'm not. It's cool. Uh, uh, I'll do it. Sean, that's really not necessary. Look, if I was standing there in his shoes 30 years ago, I might have said the exact same thing. I'm not the HBK I used to be, but one thing hasn't changed. I don't lie down for anybody. Let's see what you got, kid. Let's go, Sean. Teach him why you're the showstopper. Sorry, I was a big fan. Old habit. Seriously, Ribby. Seriously? We were tag partners, Ribby. Now you gotta do me like that. 
Bring it on, Shawn Michaels. Bop. Yeah, I didn't change my taunts. I just realized. Eat it. Ah! Ooh. Ah. Ah. Uh-oh. Bye-bye. Uh-oh. Oh, God. Oh! <laughs> hey. Hey, Road Dog. Hey! Come on, Paragon. Come on, Paragon. Come on, Paragon. I thought you were the Paragon. I thought you were the Paragon, JP! Oh, I'm gonna kill Sean. Oh god! Oh god! Bye bye. That's it. For the three. Moon so. One, two. Never mind. Oh. Castle Siege! Castle Siege! Bye bye, Paragon! Oh! Into the apron goes Road Dog. Why is Shawn Michaels just taunting? Road Dog is getting bullied out here, and I'm Shawn Michaels taunting. Don't get the Sean, stay out of this. Stay out of this, Sean. Stay out of this. Pedigree! Bonk! Like Hector Forrest just punches me. That'd be so funny, oh god. Nope. Oh, it was a bait. It was an elaborate bait. Yeah, get him, Chase! No! Get him! <laughs> Hector Morris is on his way, too. He's low, low glitch. Oh, no! Oh, God! Okay, no. Okay, you're gonna take a pedigree, too. You're, you're taking one. You're taking the pedigree, and I'm ending it. Psych, I lied. Where are you? Castle Siege! Bye bye. Bye bye. Just to make sure Sean is dead. I need to make sure Sean's out. Bye bye! Bye bye, Sean! <laughs> I just need I just need to make sure Sean stays down for, for a while. I just need to make sure Sean stays down for a while. Is he bleeding? Oh, I have another finisher. Oh, that's, that's perfect. I have another one for you, Shawnee. No! Okay, I didn't count as a first single finisher, though. Sean, I got another one for you. Eat it. Eat it. A second pedigree. A second one. Oh, my lord. Okay, that's it. That's it for Shawn Michaels. That's it, he's bleeding. I just killed Shawn Michaels. I just murdered the Hall of Famer. Congrats. You have blood coming off his head. Where are you, Christmas? Oh, oh, Shawnee boy. We're gonna get some you, but that seems like it hurt. <laughs> I'll hand it to you. Took a lot of guts to call me out and then back it up in the ring. I said I was going to make an impact, and that's exactly what I did. It was a risk, and also a bit of a shortcut. From my experience, those two things don't always work out. But this one did, didn't it? I guess so, since Triple H just texted me that he saw our match on his live feed. He said he was impressed, and he'd be keeping an eye on you. Well, there you go. Everything turned out great, didn't it? Yeah, except for my sore back. Wasn't exactly planning on competing today. Now I'm paying the price. Just keep in mind this is one match. You still have a lot to prove before you're ready for WWE. Ooh, hello, Paragon. What the hell was that? What do you mean? I mean calling out Shawn Michaels on your first day. There are unwritten rules to follow here. There's a system in place. Who do you think you are to just ignore all that? I think I'm the top prospect now. No, just because you caught an old timer off guard doesn't make you the top anything. That title still belongs to me and everyone here 
knows it. That's not what Triple H posted on social media. Wait, what did he say? Man, it sure is easy to get in your head. I'll keep that in mind going forward. Ooh, road dog. Hidden back, what was this? Hidden back a little club and guns this week. Let's see if any of these rookies can hang with the goddess. I'll hang with you. In the ring, nothing personal, unless. Take her on in the mix tag match? Oh, I'll, I'll, I'll do it with Alexia. Alright, time to team up with Alexa Bliss and take on Paragon J. Pierce and Oscar. Fun fact, this is the ninth time I'm trying this every other time I've gotten DQ'd by accident leading Oscar. Oscar got, got real close. Oh god. Dumb nickname. Loser. Yep. Dunk. Okay, can you stop that? Like, how to do a dive drop? That's how you do something! That's how you do pussy stuff, okay, JP? That's why I am the best indie wrestler of all time, and you aren't! And now... Ow... Back the crap off! Back it off! Yeah! That you can just beat me up like that? No! No! Mm hmm. Just stomp the back of your neck and. Ooh! And Paragon J Pierce down. I mean, and Alexa must have been working on that. Uh, if you can get on. Spear time? Spear time, I think. Yeah, spear time. Spear! 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 Never mind. Ooh. Ooh! Bonk! Tag work. DDTs, I think, right? Yeah. Oh, my lord. Rat! Alexa really just stood there and watched. Oh wait, we have tag finishes? Is this a spear again? I think so. Paragon, Paragon. Oh god. <laughs> okay, okay, Alexa's doing fine. He's good. Oh my gosh, J. A. Pierce wanted me gay. Insult injury signature. Pick her up for the finisher. Never mind. Nice. I got to me, and then I do tag finisher because I'm the only one with the finisher right now. Why did you pin after this DDT? Why can't you just pin him after the DDT? Okay, never mind. Who's too resilient for that? No! Eat a castle siege! Tag finisher. I don't know what it's gonna be, but it's gonna be something. Probably the spear again. Oh, my turn for the DDT. No! I see. 
I hate this. Oh, he's gonna be stunned for a while then. He seems to be stunned for a while. One, two, three. There we go! I wanted to pin Paragon, but you know that works too. That works too. Victor! I haven't checked in with you for a bit. Are you holding up? I think I'm doing all right. I mean, I wouldn't be here still if I wasn't, right? True. There's not a lot of patience for mediocrity around here. Reminds me of something my old man used to say. Good enough is only good enough if you're good enough. He really had a way with words. I think what he meant was you can coast by if you have the talent, but if not, you better work twice as hard to make up for it. Makes sense, I guess. Does he offer you gems like that all the time? Not anymore. We haven't really talked in a while. Yeah, anyway, speaking of working twice as hard, in Mexico, two out of three false matches are very popular. I was thinking it would be cool if you and I had one here at the PC. What do you think? I'd be honored. Let's do it. All right, now you weren't ready for the castle siege. This time, you weren't ready for the castle siege. I'm sorry, but I gotta die. I had to do it. One, two, three. That's one. Sorry, Hector. It's the way of the world. Been since I, uh, you, you decided to rake my eyes, I'll hit you with a second pedigree for good measure. One, two, three. Okay, you're old dog. What is my new notification? What do I have? Two out of three falls. <laughs> two out of three. Two out of three falls match someday. What? Two more times. Best of three of the two out of three. N never mind. What is it? What is it? Non televised NXT match. I'll do it. I'll drop someone out on NXT. I'm about to whoop this man. Exploder. Should be your name. Uh oh. Castle Siege. Bye bye. <laughs> Section. You're even like that. I'm Sundog. Sit, Sundog Millionaire. Mm -hmm. I've been losing to not even my finishes. It's a regular move. Hey, Sean. Remember how I beat you? So, Road Dog and I were thinking, since apparently you want to stand out so much around here. That we should come up with some new ways to challenge you. What you have in mind? One of my favorites is what I'm calling show up or throw up. Basically, you have to do 500 squats and then wrestle chase without throwing up. Sounds easy enough. I'm in. Good. Try your best not to throw up. Road Dog has a weak stomach, so he'll start blowing chunks too. And it could get ugly real fast. Oh, so my legs are tired and I'm already on a little bit of low health. That's the, the squat net. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. The Boston Crab. There we go. Alright, Chase. I'm sorry, baby. I'm so sorry. You're just crazy. I mean, you gotta die now, but hey, congrats, baby. You reversed it. One, two, two, three. Bye bye. Bye bye, baby. Show up and show up.
You're gonna need a lot harder challenges, and I think I'm gonna end this episode here. Like, subscribe, if you have not hit the notification bell down below, so you get notified whenever I upload. And I did not show, I did not throw up, and I definitely showed up. So, uh, see you guys in the next one. Bye, guys. Don't forget.